Welcome back, everybody, to the Wax Pack Flashback. You've got Jason here subbing in for Mickey this week, who is uh, crazy busy, but uh, I'm happy to sub in. I'm going to do double duty this week on the Wax Pack Flashback, sponsored by the Retro Network and TCDB.com Trading Card Database. Go check that out. Awesome resource for trading card collectors and uh, just for research in general on old sets of cards. TCDB.com. Uh, great episode today. Great because we are partnering with Retro Days and uh, RD's Retro Detention Series here on YouTube. If you have not checked it out, there is a link down below in the description. I want you to go check that out this week. Uh, I think they're up to almost 20 episodes or might be 20 episodes now of uh, just pure nostalgia. Uh, RD sits in detention and uh, talks about a certain property from back in the day. And this last week was ALF. And I got a little goodie pack in the mail. Oh, look at this. Yes, ALF is says, yo, let's party. <laughs> uh, RD was gracious enough to send us a little goodie pack with some of the uh, material that was used in uh, RD's Retro Detention in the last episode. Let's see what's in this little party bag here. We've got some goodies in here that uh, you guys might be interested in. Oh yes, there's ALF trading cards. That's what we're going to be talking about today. Uh, this is actually from Series 1. Let's see what else we got in here. Oh, there's another pack of Series 1. Oh, there's Series 2 in the red wrapper. One more thing in here. If you've listened to us on the podcast. Yes, there it is. RD's Retro Detention Trading Cards. We got these uh, in a goodie pack. I love this. Childish Pop Culture Contraband Trading Cards. Uh, we're going to go ahead and open these up. Uh, Mickey might be saving his pack. So it's good, actually. You got me here. We're going to do an extra opening this week. I'm going to open two of these the, the, from the first series and these today in our video. And then if you'll come over to Instagram at TRN Social. I'm going to open Series 2 over on Instagram a little bit later today. But let's dive into these ALF trading cards from back in the day. Okay, here we go. ALF trading cards. These are a little worse for wear, as you can see. I uh, found these at a local uh, thrift store. And uh, these are wax packs, though, believe it or not, as dirty as they are. Uh, we get five cards and one sticker, one stick of bubble gum, which may or may not have exited through that hole. <laughs> uh, let's see who these are made by back in the day. Topps Chewing Gum, Daria PA. We seem to mention that a lot. 1987 were, uh, was the year for these cards. So I'm going to open up two packs. I remember opening packs back in the day. This is actually one I do remember because of the special... Bullia baseball card that's inside. Anxious to see what we get. I would uh, imagine that the Bullia baseball card might be an MVP candidate already. Oh wow, these are a little yucky. I think it's from the gun that disintegrated. You got residue all over me here. Yep. All right. We'll save the Bullia baseball card for last. Let's see what we get here. Well, there's our sticker. Happy Light Year, 1987. Those are fun. I like the border on these. Uh, and there's a puzzle on the back, too, of ALF. I'm going to have to dust these off a little bit. Let's see what else we get. I wonder if we can deduct flea powder as a business expense. <laughs> these are fun cards. Uh, just a, a you know normal color border. You've got this fun TV logo of ALF there and then on the back there i think they're all about the same you might get i think we get some portrait or are they all landscape i might be all landscape oh there's a fun card soon alf was back to his good old self one night while willie was sleeping he connected willie's freckles with a laundry pen <laughs> melmac fact all melmacian barbers were named sid hmm well that's fun we get some melmac facts where Mr. Gordon Shumway was from. 
Don't come in yet. The kitchen needs a second coat of spaghetti sauce. <laughs> Let's look at the fact on this one. Alf advice, number three. Don't ever play the piano with your teeth. Hmm. Okay. Now well, there's Alf. Get my lawyer. Nobody calls me a letter bug. Looks like he's in a cage there. He complained that Alf was always shedding on the furniture. Alf invented a fur-covered couch. So no one would be able to tell. Didn't go over well. So Alf shaved the couch to make it look normal. <laughs> Melmax National Bird was a rubber chicken. <laughs> That's great right there. There's the whole family. Would you buy a used car from this family? <laughs> That's an, an MVP in the running here. Wow. Bubblegum dust. To run for president on Melmac, your middle name has to be the name of a cheese. Hmm. Well, fortunately, I cannot then. That's an MVP in the running there. Here's our Bullia baseball card. From the Equinox Weenies, Arnold P.U. Garlic. He was the left squibner. <laughs> that's great. I mean, these were... That's a little off-center there, but... These were almost like... Garbage Pail Kids, and the fact that they were kind of disgusting. Arnold went 16 consecutive seasons without board a board wheeling penalty. The streak was broken late last year after putting a manta ray in plate umpire Buzz Musman's chest protector. Okay, what was the original name of the Equinox Weenies? Hmm. If we can focus in. <laughs> Well, we'll tell you. I can't focus in. The card is too young. The Equinox Sausages is the answer. There we go. I came in there for a minute. Equinox Sausages. Okay, we'll put that in the running. Let's go to our second pack of ALF trading cards from Series 1. And these look equally as powderific. There's the other one. Oh, there's the... <laughs> wow. It is literally powder. That's wonderful. And I don't... I'm in the laundry room here. If you like my setup, but... <laughs> I don't have anything wet to take off some of this stuff. All right. We'll put that in the back of the pack. And we'll get a look at our sticker. Oh, now there we go. Give me four. That's a fun shot of Alf. Full body shot. Those, those shots in the show, like in the intro, when they would show Alf like in full body, <laughs> they always were a little scary to me. I don't know why. You know, you just saw the him from the neck up or uh, chest up in the TV show. So it was kind of weird. Oh, did we get the same one? We did. Man, well, that stinks. We'll put him over here. Let's see what else we got. Alf, do you ever stop eating? Can't talk now, Willie. My mouth is full. Of course. Alf loves to eat. Milmackian's favorite party game was pin the tail on the lettuce. <laughs> I got the same card in there. Look at that. We'll skip that, even though it is a great card. Smile when you call me repulsive. During the holiday season, Melmachians dress up as vegetables and dance with their neighbor's pets. What are other pets on Melmac? Not cats. I can see it's a cat, but where's the soy sauce? That's a good shot. You get a shot of Lynn, the daughter there. Never throw out dirty socks as someone... Never throw dirty socks at someone who's bigger than you. Okay. All right. Well, I think we got to go with, as much as I love the stickers, man, this is hard. If we go with the family, I kind of like that as a portrait, but, you know, of course, Alf and Booyah Baseball. Uh, Man. I think I'm going to scratch the Bully of Baseball, actually. And the the full body. I'm going to go with the family. Yeah, so you get the family and you get the picture of Alf right there. So 
That'll be my MVP for Series 1. Now, as I dust the gum off my fingers, here we go. RD's Retro Detention Cards. I might be opening a collector's item here, but I want to see all of what we get inside as far as the cards. I'm positive these are going to be from the series and episodes and trying not to tear up the package because it's a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful foil pack. There we go. Oh, they're going to give us the uh, subject. Wow, there's a lot of cards in here. A lot of cards. So let's just turn them over. There we go. There's Max Hedrum. That's one of my favorite episodes. Love that. We've got uh, Superintendent Powers, who stops in every once in a while. <laughs> there we've got Principal Homato and Dutch, the janitor. There is R.D. himself. Oh, we've got Pop Top. Oh, look at that shirt. Oh, my gosh. Max Hedrum gives R.D. a new look with a new Coke. I love that card. I might have to do that as my MVP. Vigo's Ecto. That was a great episode. On Ghostbusters 2 merch, and a lot of it was Ecto Cooler. Look at that with shot with Vigo drinking Ecto Cooler. The Snack Attack. There's where he's uh, attacked by the Noid. It's annoyed by the Noid. Yep. The Bear Scare. Oh, Teddy Ruck's been. Yep. I remember that episode. Uh, now we get the episodes here. Up through episode nine here. Okay, so episode one was Batman. That was fun. That was a great way to kick off the series, by the way. These cards are great. They're really glossy. Very well done for custom cards here. Episode two, there's your uh, new Coke versus Pepsi challenge. Not focusing today. There's a... Uh, Episode four, so I didn't get episode three. Ghostbusters two, episode six, that's uh, the Power Rangers. Episode eight, of course, there's the Noid. And episode nine, which I think was Robocop, yes. Robocop. Awesome look at these cards. Uh, they had a contest a little while back to get a goodie pack and uh, get all the cards and there was a ton of stuff in there. Uh, all kinds of stuff from the shows that they have been doing over there on YouTube. Great job guys with these cards. I'm going to give, I'm going to put an MVP here. It's going to be this one. I love the new Coke episode. So I'll save a spot here for later on today when we do ALF Series 2. But uh, yeah, we're going to put RD right in there. Great cards to go with ALF. Man, this was a great episode. Loved it. Okay, so there you have it. Very special episode of the Wax Pack Flashback today. We've got all these fun RD's Retro Detention cards. We've got all these fun ALF cards. This has been so great. Thank you guys for watching. And don't forget, over on Instagram, later today, I'm going to open up Series 2 off cards to see if these are any different than Series 1. I would imagine they're probably about the same. I don't know if they just added on as far as uh, screenshots, whatever, seasons of the episode, uh, seasons of the television show. But we will find out today over on Instagram. Hey, make sure you are subscribed down below. That would be awesome. Make sure you also like this video. That would be doubly awesome. And uh, make sure you're over on Instagram, at TRN Social over there, and watch my openings in response to Mickey. 
responding to myself this week since he's not here, but hopefully he will be back next week. Thank you, Trading Card Database. Check them out, tcdb.com. All the links are right there in the description below. So that's it for the Wax Pack Flashback this week. We'll see you again next time. This has been a presentation of the Retro Network. For more great retro pop culture content, including podcasts, videos, and articles, visit www.theretronetwork.com.